Head and neck cancer is on the rise, but doctors are now one step closer to knowing how to predict who will survive. That's thanks to a new study published in Cancer Prevention Research, a journal of the American Association for Cancer Research. Surprisingly, it found that people with HPV are more likely to beat the disease than those without. The survival in our study for patients who are HPV positive with oropharyngeal cancer was almost 90 percent, whereas the survival for the, the patients who were HPV negative was only around 30 percent. It's a breakthrough that will help doctors predict with more accuracy who will survive. That's why scientists are hailing this as a practice-changing development. We need to be analyzing HPV routinely in all our patients, and we're not yet doing that. In another twist, African Americans in this study had lower levels of HPV than whites, and were less likely to survive. Scientists used to think African Americans had lower cancer survival rates because of access or provider attitudes, but this shows there could be a biological reason. I was stunned uh, when we looked at the data. Survival for, for white patients is three times higher for oropharyngeal cancer than for black patients in our center. And these are patients who have the same stage of disease and are getting the same treatment. Survival difference is not 10 percent, 20 percent. It's threefold difference. It's an astounding difference, and it all appears to be attributable to HPV. So far, no solid explanations for why African Americans had a lower rate of HPV. The research from the University of Maryland Marlene and Stewart Greenbaum Cancer Center is funded by the state of Maryland through a grant from the Tobacco Master Settlement. Reporting from the AACR, I'm Jeremy Moore.